Hi guys, in today's short video, I'm going to give you a quick money saving tip. Maybe some of you knew this already, maybe you are using this already, um, maybe not. So I'm just aiming to the ones who are not using, so maybe I can save a couple of bucks for you. So let's go ahead. Most likely you've seen this one or at least heard of. It's a, a soap uh, dispenser. You just put the soap refill cartridge in the dispenser. You just uh, wave your hand in front of the sensor and then it gives you one portion of soap. Now at this time it's off. Uh, I disabled for the sake of the video and of course for the sake of what it's going to happen. Um, so that's why it's not doing anything. But yeah, so this soap refill over here in Hungary, it costs something around, something around almost $4, four dollars, four US dollars um, for 250 milliliters, but let's call it 350, why not? Um, for 250 milliliters, which is not cheap. So the trick is very simple. I just cut a hole with a very sharp knife on the top of this cartridge. But of course, if you want to follow what I've just done, then be super careful. Make sure you're not going to cut your hand. Um, I've got more of these cartridges. This was the second one, as you can see from the more square shaped cut. Uh, this one was the first I've done. When I trialed if it works, I've done it over a year ago, maybe even two years now. Um, that's why it's a rather non-pleasing type of cut. And then the advanced level was with the drill. This one is, well, it should be like a proper circle, but uh, it doesn't really look like that way. But anyway, so once you just need to cut a hole and then you rinse it nicely from all the fragments and then that's it and then you refill you either use one of that tools um, this one is 500 mil the same price as one of these 250 mils and lots of plastic extra plastic so i can fill up two of these cartridges for one of these for the same price so that i say that i save already half price or there are these cheaper soaps i don't want to advertise this brand um you just i just want to show you so you get the idea this one is one liter it cost me just over one dollar so the whole pack i mean the one liter so four times I can fill this one up. So let's say it cost me 25 cents from this cheaper soap, whilst this one is like $3.50 to buy. It's, it's a no-brainer. You can save shed loads of money. So that would be the idea. Now I'm just going to show you some refilling. Maybe you will like it, maybe not. And, and then that will be it about this video. as you've seen that you need to be careful with some overspill I looked a bit aside because I heard some noise and then my hand moved so that's why um, 
there is a bit of overspill. However, if you put bigger holes on it, then um, of course this one can be avoided. It's up to you. For me, this is fine. I just quickly wipe it off and then I'm a happy bunny. Um, and one more idea. I don't do it, but I had it in mind that um, just if you want to make sure that nothing goes in, then you can just cover it up with some scotch tape or some cello tape and that's it. Basically, that's the idea. So now, as you've seen, I spent something like, what, what was it, like 50 to 75 US cents to refill this free. Okay, on this occasion it was a bit more because I used the Dettol's own refill, but that's not the point. If I use any of the cheaper, not necessarily cheap, cheap, but cheaper refills, I can just refill it from 50 cents, half a dollar, 75 cents, something around that, the free, instead of like, what, nine ten ten dollars fifty so that's a win-win now i'm just going to switch them back on at the back and then i put them to their place and it's good to go um obviously if you tip it over then the liquid will or the soap will come out on the holes first of all put it to somewhere where you're not going to trip it over or tip it over um, also somewhere where it's easy to reach use common sense don't tip it over or hit it or whatever and even if you feel like doing so then just put some tape on it and then nothing will come out simple as that that's the end of the video if you like this money saving tip then please give it a thumbs up uh, consider to subscribe to the channel it costs you nothing, but uh, it helps me a lot. And um, yeah, don't forget to press the notification bell so you're not going to miss any of my upcoming videos. This type or other type, because I've got lots of different types of videos. And um, yeah, that's it, guys. Thank you for your attention and catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.